<laughs> Hello cousins, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Big Mama Cooks and I have an Instagram page where I post recipes all the time at Big Mama Cooks underscore. The second Soup Saturdays recipe is no other than broccoli cheddar soup. The smooth and rich classic soup is made in about 30 minutes. Let's get right to it. All of the ingredients are going to be listed in the bottom bar, but here we have some grated carrots, chopped broccoli, chicken stock, heavy cream, spices, butter, chopped white onion, some shredded cheddar cheese. And as a cheat code, I am letting you know I am using bagged frozen broccolis. Oh yes, I am. In a large pot on medium high heat, I am going to add in my stick of butter and let it melt. Then I'm going to go in and add in my chopped white onion and I'm going to mix this around for about two minutes or until my onion becomes translucent. Next, using a measuring cup, I'm going to measure out two cups of chicken stock. I always like to use low sodium chicken stock or chicken broth because it's easier to manipulate the sodium levels later on. So if I need to add a little more salt, I can do that without it already being salty. Next, I'm going to measure out two cups of heavy cream and I'm going to add that in and stir everything really well together. Then I'm going to measure up all of the spices that I'm going to be adding and I'm going to add this into the broth. Mix everything really well together and then we're going to move on to the carrots. If you find pre-grated carrots in your supermarket, please go ahead and buy that. I used two large carrots and I grated them myself. Then I added in my chopped broccoli. So like I mentioned earlier, I used bagged frozen broccoli i let it thaw on the counter and then i chopped it up myself with a large knife so i'm adding that in and i'm mixing this really well together again everything is going on medium high heat next i'm going to add in three cups of shredded sharp cheddar cheese the cheese that you use is optional to your preference if you prefer a mild cheddar cheese go ahead and add in mild cheddar cheese i prefer a sharp cheddar cheese so i added this in and i lowered the flame to medium low so that the cheese wouldn't stick to the sides. Next, I'm going to add in my teaspoon of nutmeg. Please don't skip over this step. Nutmeg gives your soup this necessary touch of spice. It is so good. It's not a strong flavor, but you can tell there's this tiny necessary spice in there. Again, our soup is now on medium low heat and we're going to cover our soup for 20 minutes. At the end of those 20 minutes, when you come back, your soup is ready to go. If you prefer a thicker, more velvety soup, you can go ahead and add in two to three tablespoons of flour, mix it around, cover it for another two to three minutes, and you should have a much thicker consistency. Since the soup is loaded with chunky ingredients, I prefer to have it a little on the runny side. So there you have it. You have made broccoli cheddar soup in half an hour. Decorate it with some extra cheddar cheese on top and sop it up with a piece of bread. Thank you for watching. See you next time, cousins.